<clears throat> Where are we at here? All right, this is a test. Um, doing another video for you. So here I am doing another video um, about aliens. You know, um, we just this is in the news today. Are experts really searching for alien mega structures in space? Are experts who are the experts? It ain't the people working for this government because they know this shit's out there. Matter of fact, uh, these things are flying all over the place. Matter of fact, I saw one a couple months ago when I was on a cruise ship in um, near the Queen Mary, Long Beach, and uh, here's what I shot. I actually don't think of my eyes there. there you go. It's coming up here. Notice I'm not moving the camera. This thing is moving, okay? But that's not the only one. There's another surprise added in there. Now, this was a ball. This was not a, a straight. This was a ball, a sphere that was flying around. And I, I saw one. But when I came back to edit the video, there were two, which I didn't see live. I only saw the one. It was very hard getting that camera to zoom in because I couldn't see the, uh, the viewfinder as that LED or LCD viewfinder. So... Um, you know, it wasn't like the old days where you stick your head up there. Anyway, so I don't know if you saw it on there. Um, this is my video. You can check it out, see for yourself. So what I want to do is I want to go to the rest of this video. And let's play what they have to say. This potential hypothetical civilization is a thousand years more advanced than we are. Why haven't they made contact with us? Are we as human beings just not ready for that? Well, if you go down a country road and see an anthill, do you, talk, go, do you go down to the ants and say, <laughs> I bring you trinkets, I bring you beads, I give you nuclear energy, take me to your ant queen, or you have this politically incorrect urge to step on a few of them? Uh, yeah, right, that's a very good point. It's equally as good as my theater metaphor. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I, I like both. So why should they land on the White House lawn? We have nothing to offer them. If they can build an object bigger than Jupiter, I mean... You know, these idiots... Why don't they just land on the lawn? You know, how come, you know, they're not showing themselves. If I filmed it, these spheres flying in the air, they exist. I saw them with my own eyes. I got it on videotape. That ain't enough. You want, you want them to come to the White House lawn, shake the hand. But yet, people have said that they've been working with our government since the atomic bomb went off in uh, World War II. So, you know, you all people are all full of shit. And there's enough evidence out there that these aliens exist or something is flying these craft. And if there's a craft that's a couple million miles away from us that for some reason is obstructed by um, the cosmos, do you think they, you, you, they're not scared of you? You know? You're scared of them. And what, what the knowledge is going to bring down forth uh, among the nations, when we discover that you've been lying to us for all these years, your go the governments are out, and that's what that's and and the church is out, and everybody else. That doesn't mean there's no God. It just means all these churches that have lied to us, well, they're gonna get theirs. So, anyway, that's my two cents on this alien mega structures. We live on one, okay? <laughs> all right, have a good night. Maybe that was boring. Maybe I shouldn't post this video. Sayonara. See how many hits I get on this one. <laughs>